I'm a sociologist, okay. so I work on uh, Muslims. Um, that will be my ex Muslims rather than Islam. So someone who is an expert in Islam uh, knows the texts and the uh, and knows about the Quran and the religion and the jurisprudence and the Sharia law. Uh, what I uh, expert and um, what I specialize rather is um, Muslims. How, as a sociologist, how people exercise their religion, which is in this case Islam. Uh, I arrived September 1991. I came here um, on student visa. I mean, I was a mother and uh, for me, my family was extremely important. When I came here, I had four children and I was doing a PhD. But, uh, uh, McGill was the only one who accepted the application, so I landed in, in Montreal. So I wouldn't... Um, describe myself as a social activist, although I have been recently been getting involved in community uh, activities, especially in NDG. Mainly I'm an academic, but I also participate in um, policy making, work, policy making um, processes and work with international organizations. People who don't know me and the first or second sentence is, where are you from, don't understand that how um, it insulting it can be because um, it's, uh, it, can, it, it can immediately, they want to immediately classify you into a certain stereotype so that it will make them comfortable. But that's uh, a source of discomfort for me. Uh, in, an er in an era where being a Muslim is associated with being a potential terrorist uh, uh, and all that whole package of Islamophobia that comes with it. With being, that's precisely why when they ask me where are you from, and if I say I'm from Iran, oh, so you're an Ar Iranian woman. Well, I'm no longer an Iranian woman. I'm a hyphenated Iranian woman, right? I'm, I am, after 20 years, I, am I, an, how much I'm Iranian and Canadian? I mean, we are living in a world where a lot of people are hyphenated. There are a lot of multiple identity people. People have different identities, sexual identities, or um, ethnic identity. Uh, so that's um, one of the things that I find very disturbing. Where are you from? S stereotypes are so deeply embedded. Um, and that's when I started to think about telling stories. And that's, my, uh, that's one of my projects. I want to uh, write um, uh, autobiographical creative nonfiction because if you tell stories, stories stay.